Hey everyone, Sham this side and today we are going to learn about what are solid principles. Today let's explore solid principles, a set of guidelines that helps software developers write cleaner, more maintainable code. SOLID is an acronym for five design principles that make object-oriented programming more effective. SOLID principles play a crucial role in reducing code complexity, making your code base easier to test and modify. By following these principles, developers can avoid common problems like tightly coupled code, code duplication, and difficult-to-track bugs. So, let's break down what each principle in SOLID stands for. S stands for Single Responsibility Principle or SRP. Each class should have only one responsibility or reason to change. This keeps classes focused and makes them easier to manage. Now, O stands for Open or Closed Principle or OCP. Code should be open for extension but closed for modification. In other words, you should be able to add new functionality without changing existing code, helping avoid unintended side effects. Now, L stands for LISCO Substitution Principle or LSP. Objects of a superclass should be replaceable with objects of a subclass without affecting the behavior. This ensures that derived classes extend the functionality without altering the expected outcomes. Now, I stands for Interface Segregation Principle or ISP. Classes should not be forced to implement interfaces they don't use. By creating specific, small interfaces, developers ensure classes only contain relevant functionality. Now, D stands for Dependency Inversion Principle or DIP. I-level modules shouldn't depend on low-level modules. Both should depend on abstractions. This minimizes the impact of changes in lower-level modules on higher-level logic. Applying solid principles in your code helps create software that is modular, testable, and easy to refactor. This means fewer bugs, faster updates, and more flexible, reusable components. Over time, these principles lead to a cleaner, more scalable code base. Thank you for watching and see you next time.